Hey YouTubers, just wanted to show you something I got in the mail this week. This is the Striper Live in Tokyo 1985 concert on CD, and this was put out in 2024. And so I bought this through Amazon, and it came from Amazon Japan. Cost about 27 bucks and free shipping. Took a while to get here, you know, coming from Japan. Took about three weeks to get in. But as you can see, uh, it's got some paperwork with it, and it's not your typical OBI. It's weird. It's like an outer inner sleeve with advertising. But the way that this is kind of big on the side, like I don't think that it would fit if I opened the jewel case and stuck it in the back. But at any rate, it's still cool to have. Um, so yeah, this thing came from Japan and there's the back. You can see the track listing and then here's the inside with the disc. And it does look to be a real silver pressed disc. It doesn't look like it's a uh, blue or anything like a CDR. There's the picture behind it. And I'll show you on the inner sleeve if I can get that out. Has some, you know, some liner notes inside of there talking about the band, probably talking about the show. Uh, like I said, uh, this was uh, something off of Amazon. It had one bad review on there. You know, somebody said it was trash. It was zero improvement. But I listened to it, and I think this, the, the improvement on the sound is better than the original, than if you were listening to a VHS or even listening to it on you know, YouTube or something, and the sound is consistent, so there's, you know, there's not different songs that was captured off of different recordings, so it's all the same recording. Uh, the the volume's good on it. I think the bass was pretty good. They did the best that they could with it. You know, they say they remastered it, but considering the original source, they could only do so much with it, but yeah, um, definitely cool to have. If you don't have this show in any format on CD, I recommend picking it up, and like I said, uh, as of today, I got it on Amazon around 27 bucks and had to wait for it to come from Japan, but it's a pretty cool item and I'm glad to have it as part of my collection. I've wanted it for a long time. I've seen a lot of uh, bootlegs out there on the internet of it, but this one seems to be somewhat official. I uh, don't know if it's uh, official in Striper's eyes or not, but yeah, I did get it through Amazon. I saw one on eBay pop up once but I, it was through a bidding, and as I was bidding, it only got maybe three days through the auction, and then it was taken down. And so uh, I would say that most likely um, Striper or somebody said that it was unofficial and had it removed, but, you know, still a cool item, and if Striper sold them on their website, I would definitely be buying it from them. But, uh, yeah, that's all I have for today. God bless.